Supporters, both young and old, waited patiently for just under two hours. They braved the midday sun, hoping to highlight their appalling living conditions. Uh, I think that we have been taking place several times under Tabombegi, under Nelson Mandela. But our people are still poor, are still in poverty, are still living in crime. Hopefully this one will make an impact in terms of the crime, in terms of, of, of the poverty in our area. And I hope the president will listen to us. What we need, we want to see this freedom in our lives. We don't accept to say, yes, we are the Cong uh, ANC, ANC, but our life is still in misery, poverty. There is no transformation in our lives. <laughs> When the president finally arrived, he barely had time to listen. The crowd pushing to get a glimpse of him. Zuma reiterated the party had its eye on the Western Cape. We want to take over this province. Up until then, we will remain in poverty with people looking down upon us as they govern this province. This is the only province run by people who don't know how to prosper our people. <laughs> From Philippi, he headed to the Nyanga taxi rank and then onto its train station, encouraging people to turn up in their numbers for the party's Saturday celebrations. Lukano Talado, SABC News, Cape Town.